Hello everyone, it's me, it's Ruku. Now today is a vlog. Um, I don't do many vlogs. Um, I don't like really doing vlogs. But uh, I thought this was quite important, actually. Um, I'm going to be knocking the beer on the head for at least a month. Um, it's a personal choice. Just want to see if um, I can do it. I know I can because I've done it before many a time. However, I feel that uh, as of late, you know, I've been drinking a little bit too much, so I thought I'd lay off it. So um, I'm actually going to be laying off it a little bit and I'll be documenting the process and how I feel later on and if I've lost any weight, etc. Um, well, I won't know if I've lost any weight because I don't actually own any scales because I'm a man. Don't own scales, be a man. Um, but obviously notable features will be less of a beer belly, you know, probably a bit of uh, weight loss in the face, etc. Um, I'm pretty a fit guy anyway, I'm not too bad, you know, I'm still physically active, but I just fall, you know, lay off the beer, see what happens, bit of a social experiment, as you could say. Um, so this is day one, so we are here on day one, and um, the last time I had a beer was about three days ago. Um, so, yeah, I'm not exactly craving a beer right now, nor do I really want one, and I'm not intending to drink anything today, um, so yeah, it's been a been a short process so far but my body feels okay you know I don't feel the need to have a drink uh, I'm not an alcoholic you know it's not an AA meeting but um yeah I just thought to see how it goes and uh yeah I'll just be reporting along the way so um here's the day one and uh I'll see you uh, maybe a bit later on uh oh, maybe about a week's time so I'll check in in a week's time and just see how things are going and uh Give a little update on how I am, but um, let me just have a little. Uh, you can see my my beer belly there. Let's come out a bit. You can see my beer belly there. It's not that big. Uh, this is my chest. It goes down. And there's my beer belly. There you go. There's my beer belly. Um, so yeah, it's not overly big. Um, I'm still pretty in shape. So hopefully, after a week or two, and maybe over the month, we'll see that drop. And I can't show you my face, but I'll, I will document my face. I mean, my face isn't fat anyway. Um, you know, I still have a large bit of muscle on me. Um, I'm still in good shape. So, um, yeah, we'll see how this goes. So, uh, I'll see you in about a week's time. Can't wait. So, here I am a week later after still not touching a drop of any alcohol or any beer especially. Uh, sorry for the noises. You're going to I've got the washing machine going. I've got the cooker going. Uh, cooking myself so I had to eat and also got the washing going. <laughs> yeah, I've got to catch up on the old laundry, haven't I? Now I don't have time to drink. Um, no, but in all seriousness, I don't feel too bad. I uh, still feel that I'm not really craving any beer. Um, uh, yesterday was day six, today's day seven, so I actually got a whole week. <laughs> and uh, yeah, I feel that I feel that I was craving it on day six a little bit. I was like, you know, by this point I've already pre-filmed a load of beer reviews for, for YouTube and I upload them. Um, this fucking washing machine so loud. Um, <laughs> you know, and I, I, I would crave it and uh, I would normally, uh, say, film a few videos and uh, two or three in hand normally, sit here and, and just knock out a few of them. And it felt weird and a little bit boring. Uh, didn't, didn't have nothing to do and was a bit like, what the fuck do I do now? Now I've got a little bit more free time so yeah, just going to work, doing the usual shit, housework and stuff, laundry and all that. Um, I do that anyway. I'm not a lazy person, I do that anyway. But to me, that felt a bit strange not to have that time to sit down and film a video. Um, and not really drink something, you know. And the other day, I, you know, because on social media as well is not helping, you know, I'm surrounded by beer groups on Facebook and, of course, YouTube and uh, Instagram and all that. So... For me, it was kind of temptation right in your face, really get in there, it's like bang in your face, uh, drink, 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 have a beer. And now it's, of course, uh, Oktoberfest season, and um, people are sharing all their Oktoberfest beers, and it's, it's killing me, it really is killing me. But uh, I'm going to progress and soldier on. I'm just going to move into the other room, I think, because I feel like I'm distracted by this washing machine. It's so loud in here. So. Okay, so that's better. So now I'm, I'm here in, in the room where it's a bit more quieter. Um, so as I was saying, you know, these people, uh, Facebook and, and social media and, and all that, are 
uploading all their pictures and their videos of all these Oktoberfest beers. You know, your Frasnica Royal, um, your Spatten Oktoberfest, your Laumbra Oktoberfest, and, and all the rest of them. And it is very tempting. Yeah, I'm not going to lie, it's very tempting. It's just, I'm sitting here thinking, I could murder one of those right now. Um, but as I say, this is the first week, so I haven't really craved a beer um, at all really this week other than yesterday. So day six, this being day seven, uh, which is again where I saw these Oktoberfest videos and, and uh, pictures being uploaded. Got me thinking I could really murder one, but I stay strong and I didn't. So um, again, this isn't, I'm not saying that I'm an alcoholic because I'm not. You know what I'm saying is is uh, I'm doing this for me. I'm basically not being sponsored. Well, I'm not being sponsored by anyone, and I'm not doing the sober October. I'm merely doing a sober October for myself. I'm not getting paid for it. I'm not getting sponsored. I'm, I'm not doing anything like that. It's just for me to give my liver a rest and uh, to to lose a bit of the belly. So we know the liver is an important organ, and it has a good function. And the function merely is to get rid of any toxins out of the body. Now, if you abuse that liver, like I probably already have, uh, it will start to get fatty and corrode and all the rest of it, and eventually it will go so far you can't reverse it. Uh, as we know, the, the liver is a regenerative organ, so it can regenerate. Uh, having said that, if you haven't gone too far up the scale, it can regenerate. But if you've got the high end of it where your liver's completely done for, you're not going to reverse it. And, you know, I just thought, how will this affect me? If I just love the beer, how's it going to affect me? When I have more energy, you know, when I feel better, when I lose a bit of weight? You know, and I've done this before. I've, I've not drunk before for months on end, uh, for, you know, well, I say months, you know, a month. And I did feel okay. Uh, I didn't feel much different to what, I, to what I normally would if I was drinking. But I did feel a little bit of a difference, I guess. And that's what I want to get back to. I want to get back to that. So for me, it's kind of, let's see where this goes. You know, if I lay off the beer, let's see what happens. You know, and I'm going to try my best to uh, to work hard on it. And I'm, I'm going to change my diet a little bit. I'm going to try and reduce other things in my diet. I've got a terrible sweet tooth. So hopefully less of the chocolate and the uh, fizzy drinks. And I'll switch to healthy alternatives, of course. Like more fruit and stuff like that. And... Um, I suddenly realised as well, I don't do as much walking as I once did. Although my job is very physically active and I'm still quite a fit guy, um, I don't walk as much as I normally, well, as I used to do. So for me, I think maybe including a bit more walking and, uh, you know, I'm not going to sign up to a gym or nothing. I'm not one of those, you know, if I, I can't be dealing with that. Um, so I think moving on then, uh, my plan is simple. Lay off the booze and you know for a month try and change my diet a little bit try and lay off like the the sugary foods um and also in my work as well we we do have some sort of fry ups and stuff so i'd probably avoid all of that as well to, to a degree or even cut down on it you know that sort of thing but try and get more steps in try and be a bit more active than i already am and again half the time i'm i'm so active i get fucked um you know, I'm not like a fitness freak, I'm not like, you know, I can run a marathon, I'm not nowhere near that level. I'm somewhere between the average guy and, you know, someone who's getting a little bit unfit. So I'm, I'm probably about here in the middle. And uh, again, that's why I wanted to, to do this, because I don't want to become that guy that is unfit, walking up some stairs out of breath. I don't want to be that guy that walks out and takes four steps up a hill, struggling to catch a breath. You know, I don't want to be that guy. So... My aim was to get a little bit fitter through this, just lay off the beer a little bit, uh, try and lose a bit of the old beer belly. And again, as I said, I'm still okay, still in reasonable shape. And uh, I'll just see where it goes. Yeah, I'm going to see where it goes. But um, of course, it will have an adverse effect. There's going to be some downsides to this. And the downside is I may lose a lot of YouTube followers. I may uh, lose some Instagram followers, Facebook followers, and all of this. And uh, my account may suffer from it but I, I have a plan and my plan is simply to I've got before this this whole video and stuff and this whole decision to do this was to um, uh, what's the word I'm looking for 
pre-do a load of reviews. So again, what you're seeing, hopefully, if I've done this right, and I won't know because I've already done quite doing this in the future, so I haven't actually done this yet. But my plan was to film a few beer reviews, take a few photos, etc., for Instagram, slowly release them so that by the time I've done these videos and filmed these videos and then post them on YouTube, I'm now back to drinking. So hopefully when you're watching this now, I'm back to drinking. Um, but at this current present time, I'm not. So do you see what I'm saying? It's trying to play catch up. So that was the plan. Whether it's going to be executed, I have no idea. But that's the plan, to, to keep the engagement on my social media, to keep the content going, uh, and, to, and to keep showing you guys the world of beer. Um... I don't know if that's going to come to fruition, but I'll try. And the other thing as well is I have kind of overspent a little bit. Um, this month, or should I say last month, sorry. Um, last month I had issues with the car. You know, had to get it serviced. Uh, had to spend a lot of money on it and, and get some repairs done on it. And uh, that knocked me back as well. So again, that was kind of the inspiration for this. Because I'd, I'd gone a few days without a beer anyway. And I was like, okay. I've gone two, three days without beer. I'm not, not bothered by that. I don't know what I'm standing on. Uh, where's that? It's like a bit of a, a bit of a, I think there's a little stone or something that's coming from the outside, probably from my shoe. Um, so yeah, again, I, I've gone so many days without it and I thought, let's see how far I can push this. I've done it before, I'll do it again. And uh, this time I'll document the results. You know, how's my belly going to look? How am I going to feel as a person within myself? And at the end of this week, I'll be honest with you, there's one day that I've craved a beer. One day. And, uh, you know, that's because of the social medias. But so far, I haven't touched a drop. I've still got two beers in the fridge that I will not touch. And um, I'm going to push through. I'm going to push through this. And uh, I'll, I'll be documenting it. Will I feel any better? That's the idea. You know, will I lose a bit of weight? Hopefully. You know, the idea is I'll lose a bit of the beer belly and uh, a little bit in the face, but obviously I'm not fat anyway. Um, but here we go. I'll just show you. On week one, there's been no change thus far with the beer belly because obviously it's only been a week. But there we go. There's a the beer belly. I don't know. Maybe it has. It's dropped a bit here, I think. Um, let's see. That's my chest here. So my chest is here. Looks like I have no chest actually, but I do, believe it or not, I do have pecs. Um, again, yeah, I'm, I'm just uh, seeing how it goes, and uh, I'll be documenting how I feel. But at the end of this week, I feel okay, I, I don't feel no change. Um, still feel me, so uh, yeah. Moving on then, eating a little bit more healthier. Uh, trying to flush the liver out, and uh, trying to get some more steps in. And as I say, we'll see how I feel, and hopefully lose a bit of that, so uh, yeah. I'll see you on week two, guys, and uh, yeah, wish me luck.